Come on in, dancers. Come on in. November is Native American Awareness Month. Oklahoma is home to so many Indian tribes, and not one tribe is alike. So each November, representatives of many different tribes that now call Oklahoma home put on a special assembly to teach some Tulsa sixth graders about how their ancestors came to live here. Some were forced to come by the federal government, their journey now referred to as the Trail of Tears, while others migrated following the buffalo that once roamed the prairies. Sixth graders from all 14 middle schools in Tulsa are invited to this program each year. That's almost 900 students. They listened to storytellers explain how Native Americans were forced to adopt white culture, but still preserved their own distinct traditions and languages. Why religion plays such a central part in each tribe's culture. How using sign language once let tribes speaking different languages communicate. And the importance of music and dance to all tribes. I've never seen any of the dances uh, personally before, and I thought that was real cool. Students learned why dance outfits are called regalia, not costumes, and why there's such a wide variety of types of dance, from the stately shawl dances of the women to the exuberant fancy dances of Plains Indian men. It's such a great sport I found out today. Along with introducing many Native American cultures to non-Indian students, the program also serves to instill a sense of pride in students with a Native American background. I think that it's, it gives them a sense of, of uh, who they are inside. It gives them a sense of identity because they then don't become this generic Indian, which everyone thinks lives out here in the West. They then can recognize their own tribe. Uh, and begin to exemplify the values and the cultures of that tribe by their looking at role models, people who belong to that tribe, and we hope that that encourages them to go on and succeed, graduate from high school, and go on into higher education. Edison Preparatory School, I'm Kathy Tatum, the Oklahoma News Report.